you won't believe what plastics do at minus 100 degrees Celsius. All right, so here's a wild question. What actually happens to plastic if you freeze it down to negative 100 degrees Celsius? That's colder than almost anywhere on Earth and way colder than your average kitchen freezer. Now, plastics are everywhere around us. Water bottles, straws, phone cases. But let's take it up a notch and see what happens to them at this extreme cold. At room temperature, plastics are usually flexible, right? You can bend a plastic straw or squeeze a water bottle, but drop that temperature way down to minus 100? Plastics change. They become brittle, like scary brittle. Imagine you have a plastic spoon. At this temperature, it's no longer bendy. Snap it and it shatters almost like glass. Why? Well, plastics are made of long chains of molecules. At normal temperatures, those chains can wiggle around a bit, which is why plastic is kind of soft. But when you hit minus 100, everything slows down. The molecules freeze up, literally. There's no room to move, so the plastic loses all its flexibility. Here's the cool part. Different plastics react differently. Some, like polyethylene, the stuff in plastic bags, become so fragile you could probably crumble it with your fingers. Others, like polycarbonate, might hold up a little better, but still, they're way more likely to crack if you drop them. Now this isn't just a fun science experiment, it actually matters. Think about plastic parts used in airplanes or in space. Engineers have to pick materials that won't shatter in extreme cold. So next time you hold a plastic cup, just remember, it's flexible now, but throw it into a world of minus 100, and it's a whole different story. Science, man always full of surprises. Follow our channel to solve your curiosity in material science.